Hello everyone, FPR Raptor here, and welcome back to another video on my YouTube channel. Today's video is a very, very special one. If you've not seen the video released earlier this week, I'm doing two videos this week with none other than Stormzy. So welcome to the channel. That's my brother. Excited to talk FPL today. Today's video is basically gonna be his Game Week 37 team selection. So we're recording, if you're watching this in the future, this was a Game Week 37. And excitingly, you are playing the bench boost this week. I can't believe you kept it that long. I kept as well. it that long. Because, I, I, so my brethren who is leading my um, mini league, EJ, big up EJ, you know, it's been, it's been a valiant battle. I'm not gonna be nasty. He's, he's, <laughs> he's, he's, he's done brilliantly. Yeah. So he done, wh wh when did he play? He played his wild card. What was the what was the optimum week for it? Was it week? That's a good question. I should know this. Week twenty five. I think week twenty five. Yep. When he uh, it was all the set up for the blanks and doubles. Set, that setting up, set, he set up perfectly. Yep. And when he done that, I was like, All right, "Cool, I'm gonna let him have this time, and I'm gonna wild card thirty three, get the doubles on thirty four, okay. bench boost later." But but he he done a stonker that week. He done a hundred and something. Mm. He, he 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 killed it that week. So I was like, "Nah, let me let him have that time, and then I'll try and." Catch him on this end. Okay, so we're gonna basically gonna do this video in the, the way that I would normally do one of my videos, and you've yeah. watched the videos before, yeah, yeah, so you yeah. know the, the rough order. So we're gonna go through the goalkeepers, defenders, midfields, and forwards. But of course, all 15 players matter because you're gonna be playing the bench boost chip. So we'll start with the goalkeepers. Edison, how do you feel about him as a keeper? <laughs> I feel like I couldn't believe that week when he got dropped for, who is it? Ort Ortega, yes. Yeah. What happened there? We, we picked him because he's nailed. Picked him because he was nailed and I was <laughs> mad. I was I was umming and ahhing about- and he kept a clean sheet, Ortega. Kept a clean sheet, yeah. Ortega. Yeah. I was umming and ahhing about, it was gonna be, it was either Edison and Dunk or Stones and Still, I believe. Yeah. But even then I've got PTSD from Still because I got Sanchez. I got Sanchez earlier in the season. He was dropped that week that everyone he was, got him. He, yeah. he got dropped. And then still played, and then got an assist as well. Still got an assist, but then also Sanchez came back for one game. It yeah. was like a game when he came back. So then, even then, I was just a bit like, mm. I'm, I don't even want to go there. I've, <laughs> I've already been scarred in terms of, I don't want to pick you now. Still, and then yeah. Sanchez comes. So yeah, so I ended up going for Edison. And I think he's are. fine for this week. He's fine for this week. The yeah. bigger issue that you've got is Kepper on the bench. So all it's we know that up. is he was dropped for Mendy for game week 36. But there's a debate going around. Is that just to increase the price of Mendy in the transfer window? And maybe Kepra hasn't been dropped long term. He was just giving Mendy a game. Or do you think he's do you think he's an issue you need to deal with this week? I feel like he is. Yeah. I feel, yeah, because it's it's yeah, I don't wanna He's have done it. nothing wrong, Kepper, so he's been fine. So I, I just wonder if he's gonna come back in. But <sighs> I don't know, man. I don't wanna On a bench boost. On a bench careful. boost, I want every single player playing. So even even Mara's for me, that's techie Slight as issue. well. Yeah, because yeah. you know how, how it goes with city rotation. So yeah. I think I'm gonna get rid of Kepa. So who are you looking at, do you think? Have you thought of anyone? I mean, David De Gea is there as an option, would, but that does block you from getting does, Bruno if you I, want. That's what, that's what I want. So Rashford, firstly, please, I need Rashford back. Yeah, we need him fit. For sure. I need him fit. Yep. Firstly, for just our United team. Yep. Secondly, I need you. <laughs> and then... So you then got the choice between De Gea and Bruno. Bruno's yeah. the high upside player. Exactly. So I'll probably go... So you need another keeper, potentially. I'll probably go Bruno and then I think maybe just Mendy. Maybe I'll swap. You're just going to bank on the fact. Yeah. Uh, just guess see what happens in the press conference. Because if if he comes out and says Mendy's going to be first choice for the rest of the season, it's nice and easy. But I feel like I've, you never really see that. Like even even what Pep did with Edison recently was was weird because usually any time a keeper comes in, they don't get benched. It's a long-term change. It's a long-term change, yeah, yeah, yeah. isn't it? Like, so I'm just kind of banking on the fact that I'm sure this is a long-term change, so I'll probably try okay. and get Mendy back in. So wait for the press conference, see what's yeah. said, and then maybe just go- It could be a Mendy. minus eight for me. I'm, it's looking at- It's gonna be a big double. It's gonna be a big yeah. double though. So that's but what I, I need Rashford back. Rash, okay. that, that's, a, that's a big, yeah. that's a big factor for me, that Rashford's fitness. Yeah, so maybe if, if Rashford's not fit, then you could still actually get Bruno and the hater. So yeah. that's, that offers yeah. that option. The rest of the defense, right, you've got Dunk. So we're recording this after the Esther Pinyan 17 pointer. Fucking annoying, bro. Dunk obviously got the clean sheet too, but, yeah, but what no, was the reason for Dunk? Was it the expected minutes or do you think bullet header? What were you yeah, hoping different, for? Differential. differential. So, okay. so everyone had Esther Pinyan, EJ, my bro, yep. my bro um, Eugene had Esther Pinyan. Just everyone around me in my mini leagues had them. So yep. when so that's the reason why I got a uh, Mac 10. Big okay. up Mac 10, that's what Big up Mac 10, yeah. <laughs> so that's the reason why, because everyone had Matoma in March. Yep. So I was like, all right, cool. There's no point in me, otherwise all our teams, and I'm not, I, I, even, I like the excitement of FPL where it's like, 
I've got these differentials and you got that person. I hate it when everyone's teams is become a bit similar. Yep. So that's why I got Mac 10 and that's why I got Dunk. Cause you know, Dunk's good for an odd header now and then. Bullet header it comes. You know yeah, what I mean? So, 15 point of bullet head is the dream. So but. I was hoping that, yep. you know what I mean? Dunk comes in and manages some sort of attacking return, but that's the pin, that fucking goal. When it, when it, when it went in, uh, it was running, but I just see, I was, I think I was far from the telly. I just see a black guy. I was thinking, <laughs> I hope this is Casado or yeah, I, was, yeah. <laughs> I hope it's anyone but him when it kills Esther Perez. I was like, fucking over. Last so, minute as well. Yeah, man. So painful. That, that okay, well, hopefully Dunk Bullet had a coming for hopefully, you then. Yeah. Cool. We've got Luke Shaw. We've got to talk about our boy Luke Shaw because yeah. he's been unbelievable this season. I don't know why I benched him this week. Yeah, you benched sorry, him. Luke, man. I saw that against Wolves. It wasn't even a, nothing against it. The rest so, of your team was just so strong. Yeah, yeah. It was just it was just all the doublers, man. And then like you've got Dunk, Botman, and Trippier with the doubles this week and Trent. Like, who yeah, are you gonna yeah, start yeah, sure yeah. instead of? It's difficult. So Okay, that's fair enough. And you got three single game week players this week. You got Trent, Trippier, Botman. I don't think any of them pose major issues. Like none of them are massive issues. No. Or are you looking at potentially moving some of them on? No, I would, I'll keep all of them for this week. Uh, I think so. My issues for me is Mares. Mares, yeah, we're looking midfield now. So Mares is an issue. Mares is an issue. Rashford. Rashford's fitness is an issue. I'll I'll, I'll swap Greenwood for some uh, for someone and Kepa. It's Kepa issue. That's so why four I'm, issues, yeah, but two free transfers. So it's only yeah. a minus eight to get yeah. 15 solid players. Do you think Mahrez is an issue considering there's two games there? Do you not expect him to start at least this, one? This is, this is, oh, wait, hang on. Oh, just, okay. So <laughs> I've, I've, no, my, my, everything's changed because the reason why I thought Mahrez was an issue is because I thought that the league might not be wrapped. So what was going to happen was... Pay full strength. Pay full strength. Which might be which, Grealish. Which would be Fulham. Grealish okay. going around silver. And then, but now that the league's wrapped, the league's, yeah, basically wrapped up. Yep. You know what I mean? I, okay. I don't know. I don't know what that means. Like, I mean, I'd be tempted to keep him, but you wouldn't be surprised if bench him. Pep's just like that. Oh, he just well, can't predict Pep. I don't want no city players. But yeah. to be fair, because it's a double, I, I, I'm sure he gets. You, you'd like to think he gets. I don't know. At least ninety minutes between the two, hundred minutes between the two. So I'll probably keep Mares, even though. Don't no, I reckon Grealish. It's gonna be. It will be Grealish, isn't it? Grealish on the left, Mars on the right, though. It's if Foden then gets minutes. And I think Foden will get minutes. Bernardo Silva can play on the right. This is the issue. They've got so many options. But or do I bring Foden in? But Foden's now been benched in a couple. It's just so difficult to predict. Or do you just move away from that completely? Because you could just bring in if Rashford is fine. You could get Bruno for Mahrez and just move away from the City mm. midfielders. Completely. Could I get Bruno for Mahrez? Have I got that money in the bank? If you did that, you'd have to make one downgrade. But it might be, for example, Trippier's got Leicester, but you could bring in like a cheaper double game week mm. midfielder, uh, defender, or you could downgrade Izak because, again, no more doubles this season mm. to like a Solanke. So there are ways to get Bruno in for, uh, for Mares. There's that option. Now, you've got 1.8 million in the bank, so you've got a little bit of wiggle yeah. room, but then you've also got Greenwood sat on the bench. Yeah. So this was going to be my question, but I don't actually know how to advise here. So you've got Greenwood on the bench, but no one really to move to. You could either jiggle some funds around and get Greenwood up, or you could just almost see that as a dead spot. And just focus your bench, your bench was on the fourteen of the fifteen players. I could, I could, but then also when I think of like my original plan, so my, this was always the plan. It was always going to be Salah to Fernandez. Okay, I, like, I actually like that. Yeah, Salah to Fernandez. Yep. Which for, then I've got a shitload of money. Salah to Fernandez. Then I was going to do Greenwood to Jesus. But even now, I'm thinking I don't even know if I want Arsenal players because. They might have lost Wrapped all up. the... Could play in Ketty or something yeah, like that. Like, yeah, as in, I, yeah, and also I just thought, I don't know, I thought to myself, if I'm the, the Arsenal striker now, am I flipping gunning for yeah. that goal? Like, do not you, so much, you know what I mean? Do you think like, about the psychology a lot for the yeah, final few yeah, game weeks? Yeah, yeah. like, we call it like teams on the beach and like teams not really playing for yeah. anything. So that means a lot to you. So, I, so even on a, like, so even I've taken I've taken punts on... So that's that was my big thing with Aubameyang. I said, oh, he's coming back Hungry, to the wants to prove a he's point. Gonna, yeah, well, yeah. Okay, that turned out differently. But um, I, I do kind of think of psychology. So even what was another another one I'd done one time? Like if, um, if remember when uh, Brighton United in the semi-final, when yeah. March missed the penalty. I thought March had come back I on thought, a prove yeah, a point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so a part of me was thinking, oh, is it Mac 10 or March? And I was like, yeah. I reckon March just says, uh, you know what I mean? Revenge, I got some, yeah, yeah. Revenge, like, yeah. Um, and I captain Saka the, the week, there was a week where everyone was talking about um, getting rid of Saka, but like, the, the, so what did Saka do the week before? And I was basically, now I'm going to captain him. Because I think Saka's, 
I think he's a he's a warrior, and I think he's yeah, like, he is. I, I think he's not back against the wall. I think like, alright, cool. He's had a couple blanks. I reckon he. he Elite like, mentality. Yeah, so I, I yeah, captain yeah. him on a on a good week to captain him. So, yeah, man. Like I I I like to think about the psychology. To, to some degree, but sometimes you take these punts and it's like you are worlds apart from the truth. But you need to, because we look at these little shirts on a screen, but these are people, right? So yeah, they're yeah, going to exactly. act in a certain way. And I think that's important. I mean, my, my background as well, I, I like to think about the psychology. So I think for the final few, absolutely. Would you feel, so we're recording this before the Liverpool Leicester game. Let's say Salah gets a, a couple against Leicester. Would you still feel comfortable doing him to Bruno? Or do you think that would put you off? Because Liverpool still have something to play for, right? They're still um, going to be I would still get rid, you know? Only because sometimes when I when I if I have a plan, yeah, and I'm and I say this is what this player is going on this week and this is what I'm doing. You like to stick to that. I like to stick to it. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? So I don't let. Sometimes I don't let form dictate to you. Yeah, yeah. because form has oh, it's gotten me sometimes, man. I I got I got armor on. You know, I, after, I'm at the wrong point. Yeah, the yeah, wrong yeah, point. The like, and then even then, yeah. I do this thing as well. I, when I have the player for a, a period of time, I don't want to let them go because I'm like, if you go and. Get some, uh, do some fucking big haul. I'll be so pissed, like. So I'll, I'll keep them, and then they're blanking, blanking, blanking. And when I should get rid of them, yeah, I still keep them because I'm like, I want to be the person who still had you when you got that 15 point or something. FPL is all about timing, isn't it? Yeah. Because like you can predict a player. We've done this before. You bring them in, you're like, I've got, I've nailed it. And yeah, then you yeah, take yeah. them out, and then they start exactly. scoring. Then you bring them in, and they stop. And that's the worst. That that feeling yeah. for me is the worst. Like knowing that I got rid knowing of them. Knowing you were right, that was the worst one at the man. wrong time. Worst, yeah. worst, worst. Yeah, definitely. So. We're looking at this, by the way, let us know down below in the comments because you'll watch this video, right? Yeah, yeah, and you'll scroll through yeah, the yeah, comments. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if this was your team and you were bench boosting in game week 37, what would your transfers be? Would you be willing to take a minus eight? Storms can have a read through the comments. Yeah, please, yeah, help me out there, man. <laughs> because, yeah, please, yeah, yeah, yeah. Load up the <laughs> load up the comments. I've got a mini league to win. Um, How many points do you need in for, so for the mini league? Before, that's most of you. before this week, it was, so the gap was 88 points. Yeah. I managed... With, with 88, okay. 88, between weeks 32... When you first started playing all your chips? I started playing all my chips to, to now 30, going into 37. Before this week, before uh, game week 37 started, I'd closed it to 13 points or 17 oh, wow. points. Okay. So I was right on his neck, like, yeah. and then Callum Wilson. Lo and behold, Callum Wilson. So I'm hoping... Yeah. I don't 13 know. Points is, is 13 points is... Bench boost will bench hopefully boost, give you 15, so even, 20 points. Th I, even when it happened, I was like, you like fucked my video with Raptor here. Yeah. Because yeah. I was gonna, <laughs> I was going to walk in here on All some... Confident. Oh, Top listen, of my mini league, yeah. I'm coming like, listen, this bench boost is going to take me. And then yep. Callum Wilson, lo yeah. and behold, he is... He, I, I always say like, Wilson... An injury-free Wilson Scores is goals. top yeah. three strikers in the Prem. Yeah. Like, you know what I mean? He's, he's, a, he's, a, he's a bad boy, so... Yeah. He, he's he's fucked my week here, but then, yeah. So I'm, now it's I want to say I think I'm thirty six points. Okay. So we've still half a game week to play, half a and game then bench week, boost. Still bench boost. You can there. take some big risk in game week thirty eight, final week. Bit yeah, of fun. I'm gonna need to do. Yeah. To, to be fair, if 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 all looks lost, game week thirty eight, I'm doing something stupid. I'm doing something. Captain a random player. I'm gonna, or I or might or... captain Edison. <laughs> As in, don't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> I might. Do, I'm gonna do something so outlandish, just yeah. like to make up the ground in it. Like, I'll probably captain Harlan because what's the point? You, you can't not. You can't not. I think there are better places to take yeah. risks potentially, but yeah. Okay, so I'm thinking, yeah, Bruno coming in is important. Mm -hmm. Wait on Rashford. Press conference, wait on the Kepa press yeah. conference. And then maybe let's get Greenwood up to a cheaper striker. But like yeah. I said, let us know down below in the comments what you would do with this team. For, for me, in an idle world, in an idle world, Rashford is fit and, and firing. Yep. Salah to Fernandez. Yep, for the United triple up. For the United That's triple That's a good up. couple of fixtures for and Chelsea. Big fixtures for us. Yep. And then Greenwood to anyone. Mid price because striker, I, yeah. I, I, I think. Gabby Jesus has a forest. So yeah. I can't, I can't yeah. but again, they've got nothing to they've probably nothing play, to for play for now. But but some sort of some sort of uh, decent striker. That's, you could take a punt in that spot. Even even who's playing who's playing up top for Chelsea? Ch Chelsea, I don't want to go near them because even they got a double. You can't so. you can't look at that team and t and say <laughs> where the goal scorer is because I, I think I would have a free shot for a Chelsea striker. But who do you who go the for? Fuck is that? Chelsea fans are gonna kill me after this. <laughs> but who I don't know, who is the who is their focal point up top in it? Yeah. Like? So I'll 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 switch Kepa for 
Mendy if he's if he's the Chelsea keeper. And if not, maybe just hope for Kepa. If we get some sort of nod that it was just a one-off, then... Yeah, I'm, but otherwise, I need, I need that Mendy. in writing. Yeah. <laughs> I need that in writing, and then I'll swap, swap green. I'll, I'll, I'll be taking... In the idle world, I take minus a four. minus four. Okay, and, and that's fine. And I have 12 doublers in my bench boost. Strong. Strong against... EJ, who what would EJ have? I always and I always calculate everyone else's teams. It's like, the psychology behind mini leagues yeah, as well. Like yeah, you can yeah, try yeah. and plan what they're doing and, and defend I, I, them. So like even that. I knew he was he was doing the Wilson um, Isak double up. I knew that weeks ago. Yeah. I, I always know what he's doing. He's I've got him sus. <laughs> um, but yeah, I so yeah, I'll figure it out. But hopefully that thirty six point gap. Hopefully the the second Newcastle game doesn't make. Does it he have McAllister? Better. He bought he bought in McAllister to because defend, of me. Yeah, to yeah, 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 yeah. So, so he had March. And then he and went then to he, Yeah, yeah. So he took a minus four, bought okay. in bought in McAllister and bought in Wilson. I, and bought in Isak. I was like, yeah, shock. And then so now our teams are even mad similar. Like So you might need to that I reckon that Greenwood spot, have a little think about we'll, yeah, we'll some strikers. Who do, yeah, yeah. Who do you think? There'll be some strikers like I kind of fancy Solanke against Man United, but then Easy. again. Yeah, I don't know. I just got a bad feeling, but you've got Luke Shaw, so maybe that doesn't make sense. Yeah. I mean, I'd want Gabriel Jesus. Yeah, but if Enketia starts, then there's a risk. Or if they could start anyone, if the league's wrapped up, they could just really mix it up. I think they'll still start Jesus, but I'm trying to think who is like another striker. I mean, you could there? if you move Botman out, you could get Callum Wilson against Leicester. But, but then he's got a he's got Wilson. Got, yeah, yeah, so you need to mix yeah, it up. Yeah, I need to I need to find like Again, let us know in the comments. Yeah, please. In that man. Greenwood spot, you'd have up to if you do Salisbury, you'd have up to about eight mil, eight point five mil ish. Yeah. Who would you any striker to try and be different to mix it up? And we'll have a scroll through up in the top comment does, probably. Does, is Nunes playing? Does he play, is he getting full nineties now? He's not really in it. Jota, I had I, I just got rid of Jota. Yeah, he's, they just don't get the minutes, especially with Diaz yeah. back and Firmino, and they've got too many again options. Yeah, Liverpool don't. Do, but Nunes was my guy at one point. I love. I him. was banking yeah. him. Um, yeah, I don't know. Maybe Tony. Maybe bring back Tony. Tony, yeah, but he guys apparently has an injury to worry about, oh, which is why he missed out for thirty six. Um, it's tough. The forwards this year because a lot you didn't play last year, but last year. The forwards are elite. Oh, and like you it? wanted for this year. There's, there's not that many to yeah, choose from. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. But but Bruno in Kepa to Mendy look relatively likely, and then yeah, it's that Greenwood spot. You that got a bit of fun spot. to have. And I've ho- got a hope to God that Mara's gets minutes because everyone's got Greedish. Like EJ's got Greedish. We'll see what happens in the Madrid game. Yeah, I think. It, I, to be fair, I want them to win that just so that like. He continues getting. There's a bit more clarity here, isn't it? Yeah. But even then, but what's the what's what's the between the say say if City beat Madrid, the final is end of May. It's after the season. Yeah. yeah. So so game week 37 probably Pep might want to get rhythm for his best players. So maybe we don't want him to qualify. I could, you can't predict this Pep guy, bro. <laughs> There's some weeks, bro. I wake, I say, bro, I want to swear at him in the sense of. I'm convinced he plays FPL and he's doing it to piss us off. So he's just trolling. Yeah, he's just it? trolling. He plays FPL. I can't figure it out. Like even, so I, I remember. So my sister plays as well, and I was telling her get KDB for um, the double. Yeah. Lo and behold, I see <laughs> KDB. Nowhere, yeah. I see KDB on the on the sideline in a tracksuit. <laughs> Chilling. I said they are taking a piss, bro. So even more, like I, I, when it comes to Pep, I cannot predict yep. anything. That's that Harland is the only one. I put my money on. Have you thought about a different captain for thirty seven, or do you think you're gonna stay safe with Haaland and oh, use no, your? I'm staying safe with Haaland. If if um if Rashford was fit, and yeah, I like Rashford. So, I, do you think I Rashford would be your vice if he's fit? If he's fit, yeah. And then oh, even a even a cheeky Matoma, you know. I mean, that I first game that... against a relegated Southampton side at home. That's a. What good do you game. think I do? Because I feel like this game week thirty seven. Is this the t- is this do I need to throw the kitchen sink at it and do something? Do I need to knock Captain Harland? I think let's see how the second half of game week 36 goes. Mm. If you're still 35, 40 points off, you probably do need to throw the kitchen sink. Yeah. But if you're back down to 15, 20 points, because the bench boost is in a in my world, the bench boost gets you 15, 20 points. So mm. I, I wouldn't start taking massive risk of captaincy. Yeah, yeah, but if yeah, you're still yeah, 35, yeah. 40 points off, you can't wait for game week 38. You've got to go for it, I think. Because also, I think. So the, the EJ is the the target. He's my he's my brother. I love you. You'll have to tell him to watch this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He'll watch this. I love you. That's my brother. But I got to get him. So because <laughs> I feel like EJ is gonna have, he will have three, Brighton. Yep. Is it the same three? Brighton. No. He's got Espinion. No, Espinion. Okay. So and then he doesn't have. 
in the United, he got rid... Did he get rid of Rashford? Or was Rashford on his bench? Either way, he might have won United, that's it. So that could be a differential. That could be a differential. And then he's got Harlan, of course, and then he's got Grealish. So he's got six doublers, and I'm hoping to have yeah. 12. Oh. I'm hoping You've to got have 12 think, doublers and, and my bench boost. So... You know what I mean? I feel like if if now's the time to like just get like a monster score against them. So you man. probably don't need to go differential with the captain. I feel like you've got enough yeah, extra yeah, fixtures yeah, to yeah, just... Yeah, yeah, and then yeah, in 38, yeah. if you need it, that's when you spice it up. Spice it up, innit? Differential captain. Okay. Plan of action then. Plan of action. Yeah, let us know in the comments, please. Yeah, let's, 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 let us know down below. But even anytime you do a deadline stream, I'm de even sometimes I try and get my comment in that. You're in the deadline stream? Yeah, yeah. Once one week I was like... Um, is this on like I'm, a burner account? No, I'm not gonna see it. No, no. My, so my my YouTube my YouTube account's just like it's just like my my normal work email. Like, it's just yeah. like a normal account. And I, I remember I was, I was I was mad thinking to get Alvarez every two minutes. I'm like asking the question. Should I get <laughs> Alvarez? Should I, should I get Alvarez? I'm just ignoring the message. Getting ignored, yeah. but yeah, I'm always there for the dead live stream. Like, every there's not there's not a video you ain't dropped that I ain't seen. This Sweet season, I've watched everyone, man. It's been brilliant, man. Well, I'll update on the deadline stream this week. Yes, and hopefully, we'll, I'll, I'll maybe bring your team up on the deadline stream. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah no, do, bring you up, do, do your yeah. poll, do the, the wheel of... Uh, do, do, do all of that, <laughs> Spin man. the wheel. Yeah, spin, spin the wheel. The wheel like that, that, yeah, man. you know what? We'll do a spin of the wheel for Stormzy then. And we'll hopefully work out what to do with your team. Wicked, wicked. Sweet. All right, then. Well, that's it. That is the Game Week 37 team selection. If you haven't watched the first video, it was more of an introduction to Stormzy playing FPL, how his season's gone thus far, and some kind of the decisions that he makes around that. So go check that out. Massive thank you for coming on the channel. Thank you, my I brother. I really appreciate You're a legend, it. Brother. Respect, no, man. Appreciate it. And yeah, make sure to subscribe. We are on the road to 70,000 subscribers. Drop a like on the video. Let's aim for 5,000 likes. Is that optimistic? Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. 5,000 likes then. And yeah, make sure to subscribe, and I will see you next time.